Hi, this is Java Tips. Today I'm gonna show you how to install Eclipse and run your first Java web application. Go to Google and search Eclipse Download. Click Eclipse IDE for Java EE developers. Just choose the package that most closely your needs. Eclipse is hosted on many mirrors throughout the world. Please select the closest one to you and start to download. Go to Google and search Download Tomcat 7. Go to Apache Download website. Select the closest mirror and choose the package that suits your need and download. Double click to install Tomcat Server. Choose username and password for administrator. This is optional. Select the path of JRE and destination folder to install Tomcat. To install clips, simply extract the zip file. Double click to run a clips. Workspace is the directory on your hard drive to store a project that you create. When you specify directory to Eclipse, it to create some file in it to manage the projects. Right-click, select New, Dynamic Web Project from the menu. Choose any name for this project. And click New Runtime. Apache Tomcat 7. Click Browse to navigate to Tomcat installation directory. Select the folder, then click OK. Click Install JREs. Remove existing one and click Add to configure new one. Browse to where you install JDK. Select the folder. Then click OK. Click Finish. Check the JDK. Click Apply. Then OK. Change JRE. Then click Finish. Click Finish. Right-click to Web Content, select New, JSP File. Type Hello.JSP, then click Finish. Change the title. And add some text message.
Go to Window menu, select Show View Other. Under Server, select Servers, then click OK. You can rearrange Eclipse windows by drag and drop them around. Select Servers to add new server, Tomcat 7 server. Move the application to the right to deploy to Tomcat 7 server. To check server runtime environment, go to Window menu, click Preferences. Under Server, click Runtime environment. Select the server, then click Edit. Make sure that JRE is same as Java Viewpath. Start Tomcat server. Expand servers in Project Explorer. Open server.xml. Click on source to open the file by text editor. Application path is located under Contact tag. Open web browser and type. That's how JSB works. Right click to the project, select new, subject. Choose any package. and name for the sublet. Click Finish. Eclipse will generate some code template. Just remove them. In this example, we use doGet method and print writer class to write message to web browser. Import the missing class to the class. And print some text message to web browser using print line method. In Sublet 3.0, Sublet is registered using annotation, so you don't need to do it in web.xml. Clean and build the project. Sublet path is located under Sublet class. You need to restart Tomcat server to apply Sublet registration. And try again. That's it.